Hannah. You okay? So we opened the door to check and see, and we even asked the people down the hall, which wasn't that far away, I'd say about eight feet from where we were. And then we said, did you guys hear that? And they said, no, we didn't hear anything. So it was an isolated incident. Well, I had no idea that in that time frame that I was investigating for about 25 minutes, my girlfriend was actually trying to call me. At that time, she let me know someone had actually been attacked. William. Hey, buddy. William. What happened? Is everything all right? cold sweats, I was genuinely concerned for his well-being. But once I asked him a few questions and I knew that he was not taken over, I, I felt it was safe to start trying to find out exactly what happened to him. Did it attack you? It was huge. I felt dangerous. Look, look, look at me, look at me. It was a demon that tried to take you over. Okay? It did. You're gonna be all right. Okay. Okay? Do you know what they're reading? Do you know what do you know what it was? What did the meter say? I looked at it. Did it say about five? Was it six or seven? That's when she started acting weird. She started shaking, and I was like, are you okay? She told me what she heard in the EVP. Then that's when she started feeling really scared, jittery, and out of control, like she didn't know what to do next. And she said it felt like she wasn't there anymore. Idiots. 